Hey, it's Kathy Dempsey and greetings from Scottsdale, Arizona. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, we're here with you today just to check in and tell you about our new book, Shed Series book, 52 Questions That Can Transform Your Life and Work, the COVID edition. And here with me is David. Hello, everyone. Uh, also here from Scottsdale and uh, I'm a private practice uh, clinical psychologist here and had the pleasure and uh, privilege of co-authoring a book with Kathy uh, that just came out actually at the beginning of this year. Uh, and the title of that book was called Shed Happens um, and it included seven ways to overcome you know, challenges at work and in life. And interestingly, when that book came out, you know, we had a, in one of the chapters, we had 72, a list of 72 things that um, are big challenges that people might have faced, all kinds of things from small things like getting a flat tire to, to a death of a spouse to going through a divorce. And so we had a list of 72 things and, and people were amazed at how many things had happened to them. But one thing that was not on the list because we had no idea it was coming, was of course the COVID-19 coronavirus that certainly has become the biggest shed happens in our lifetime. Um, and thus, we decided maybe to write a little follow-up mini book um, with thought-provoking questions that can help people kind of navigate through this terrible pandemic. Yeah, so he, here's a copy of the Shed Series 52 Questions That Can uh, Transform Your Life and Work COVID Edition that's just coming out this week. So we're like so excited about it. And uh, we're hoping that these questions will really provoke you either if you can do it by yourself uh, or you can do it with your partner or family or uh, a lot of people ordering this for their team members and leaders in the organization um, that'll help stir some conversations that will help uh, process this crazy year. Um, so let me give you a few examples. Like, what did you hate most about COVID? Um, that probably is not difficult for many people to answer. Uh, uh, that's probably quick to the response. Um, but there's there's a few others. What did you like most um, about COVID? What, what was the unexpected blessing of COVID? Uh, what, what would you say, David? Well, there's a lot of things that uh, I've hated. And of course, as a pri private practice uh, therapist, you know, I've come across so many patients that have been dealing with fear and anxiety, depression. Um, and as I was telling Kathy earlier that, you know, the number of suicide deaths has just been skyrocketing. And in fact, last week I read an article that in Japan, just in the month of October alone, they had more suicide deaths than they've had COVID deaths for the entire year. Mm -hmm which is just so astounding and disturbing. Um, so it's a reminder of what I hate that, uh, you know, not only are people dying up to th over 300,000 now in the United States, but people are losing their jobs, losing their source of income, uh, having relationships, you know, really strained. Um, so the collateral damage has just been huge. Uh, so that's kind of what I've hated. Uh, on the positive side, one of the blessings for me, me personally is just uh, being deprived of being able to see relatives and friends in person um, has been a blessing in disguise because it's made me more aware of just how important our relationships are with people mm -hmm. and how eager we are to get back to being able to see them in person again. Yeah, absolutely. Makes you appreciate what we don't have even more. Hmm. So uh, we just wanted to uh, announce and uh, our, our book, uh, you two questions, COVID decision book, and wanted to share with you that we've got a holiday special. So now between the end of the year, we've got 
two books for ten dollars and no limit there so if you want to buy 20 books um uh to give them to all your friends or family or employees or 200 books or 2000 books like we've had some orders um just let us know uh you can go to keepshedding.com and click on the products page and uh, we'd be glad to to ship those off to you um, before the end of the year. So um, again, blessings to you. Um, we know this has been a difficult year for everyone in, in some, some form or matter. And um, we um, encourage you to process, to reflect, and, and hopefully the 52 questions book will help you do that. So thanks again for joining us today. Check out keepshedding.com. Bye, Stay guys. Healthy. Stay healthy and well. <laughs>